Hello everyone and a happy Manga Monday to you. Welcome back. Thanks for joining me. And if you're new here, hi, hello, welcome, welcome. My name is Zoe and this is my channel, Ms. Manga, where I talk a lot about, you guessed it, manga. <laughs> shocking i know but uh yeah today i am going to and by today i mean like this video because this video might take me more than one actual day for me anyway but it'll all be condensed into one video for you lucky you <laughs> so i'm going to be rearranging this room there's a bit i don't like about it which is that corner right there behind me um, the, these two big bookshelves kind of stick out more, making it hard to get to the end of the manga on this bookshelf. And I really just don't like how awkward it looks. On the camera, it looks okay, but like in person, it bugs me more. And uh, yeah, so I'm hoping I bought two smallish bookcases. They're over there in their boxes still. And I have to unpack them and put them together. Yay! <laughs> just it's just a tedious thing it's just yeah but then I'll have another bookcase and that's exciting so I once I put them together I'm gonna put one which I think should go up to about this height I'm thinking that's like my estimation it should hit or like just before that shelf and uh, that I'm gonna put a kind of kitty corner so that it faces out <laughs> this explanation is crap I'm sorry but so it faces out and then a smaller bookshelf here so that nothing is kind of behind anything. And I'm gonna move the longer bookshelf over to there, that shorter bookshelf over next to the bookshelf that I, you know, I'm gonna not lay flat, but kind of angle it in between that bookshelf and the other. So yeah, I'm hoping it all works out as good as it's in my head. But I guess we won't know until <laughs> we see it. And yeah, so I'm just gonna take you through that process. Of course, it's gonna be sped up. You're not gonna have to take an hour out of your time to watch me put together a bookshelf because that's probably how long it'll actually take. And yeah, and then I'll just be, I have an idea of where I want the manga to go. I'm thinking all of these manga behind me are gonna be complete. And then all the manga on the other side of the room, which you don't get to see when I film, but I get to look at, will be my ongoing manga. So that's like the idea. I'm hoping it's working out because I'm putting the two new bookshelves over there so that I'll have enough room. I don't know. We'll see. But that's my plan. And then I want to put my Banmei and my Webtoons over here. And then all the other ongoing series or series that I at least have not finished collecting. <laughs> we'll go over there. So yeah, that's that's my idea. That's my plan. And I hope that you will enjoy watching this video and seeing how well my plan turns out. <laughs> and of course, if you like this video, please give it a little thumbs up. I have no idea if this is going to be a fun video or a shit show, but y you can be supportive in either way. <laughs> just, hit, just hit the button and we'll see how it goes. <laughs> experiment maybe liking it off the bat will make you like the video it's like a sunk cost fallacy you've already liked it so you might as well enjoy it <laughs> i don't know what i'm saying <sighs> i'm really i think i'm just like i honestly think i'm just continuing to talk because i don't actually want to do the room i just want to go like this and have it be done like that'd be awesome i could do that for you but i can't do it for me i actually have to do it so i'm just procrastinating at this point i'm a really good procrastinator <laughs> But okay, okay, let's go, let's do it. <laughs> okay, here I am. I closed that door because that room, my room is actually a freaking pigsty. I got my building partner here, Izzy. She always likes to help. And I'm gonna build my bookshelf. So it's gonna have like pink inside it and then the white on the outside. I don't know, I thought it'd be cute. It was Are you cute. ready to build a bookie? Are you ready to build a book? <laughs> <laughs> you are so cute. I can't. I can't wait. You. You're so cute. Alright, I think I need these ones.
It's just one pink one. The all the rest are the right way. <laughs> I screwed it up. Only this one is facing up pink. All the rest are facing down white. With the pink on the other side. I mean, it's like an accent, right? Uh, we're so close, so close, so close, fucked it up. Slanted, and so these are not going to. <sighs> and I didn't think of that, but oh well. I don't think it's terrible per se. First of all, just my room is an absolute <laughs> mess. More books, books, books everywhere. Books. Okay, I look haggard. It's not cute but I'm gonna be sweating my ass off. Anyway, rearranging all these books. So I'm taking all of the webtoons and the ongoing series off of here. So I got the bookshelves looking mostly good. Um, there is this sad little crack in there. I just can't line it up perfectly because the floors in old houses are just not level and it's sad. Anyway, I'm just gonna be moving a lot of books around and then filling the bookshelves back up. Fun times, let's go. I bought these, which are shit, don't buy them. They literally just like let all the books collapse on me in the crap and they're way too expensive for pieces of fucking cardboard. So my advice, don't buy them. <laughs> and instead I saw a really cheap, awesome hack online on like reels or something. Take some empty freaking egg cartons Same thing, way cheaper. You eat eggs, this'll be a great hack for you. I mean, they even seem sturdier. Don't be dumb like me. Get egg cartons if you want to double stack your books so then you can see them better. So let's refill this shelf, shall we? So I'm gonna put series I've already read in the back and that are shorter. I'm still sticking with the fantasy theme, but like I already read Her Majesty's Dog. So I'm gonna stick that back there. It's very nice. You can like pull it out a little bit more maybe to make it a bit more so it's in the middle. Uh, you can see. It's fine. Whatever. <laughs> the sad part is to find the rest of the series. The rest of this. This is the 11 volume series. It's uh, out of print now. But yeah. I really like the last cover. It's so cute. Make up the beauty, which is a great series. You should read it. Okay. Back again. Guess who's back? Tell the friend. I need shut up. <laughs> okay, so I just have a few more books, but because books fell down on me, I have now lost 
volume one of that series. <laughs> They are all out of order. Two. This one's so pretty. This one's so pretty. Okay. This and this. sweating <laughs> okay so the fantasy series uh fantasy bleh, the fantasy shop is coming along nicely very happy with it um <sighs> i am sweating <laughs> but uh yeah let me give you a quick little run through of it so i kept the first shelves the same with fruits basket and all that um, and then I moved Wake Up Sleeping Beauty, Sacred Blacksmith, uh, Eureka 7 up there. And then I put, well, some of the series, like Orange, I haven't read yet. I have read. Um, I've read most of <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I ever finished. I said I should go back and reread. The more ones I've read in the back. And then this shelf. Got Gakko and Alice, some short series I've read. Everything on this shelf I've read. So, yeah, and then down here, we got Chippy Vampire in the front, the recipe for Gertrude, which I haven't read yet, Psychono, and Full Muggle Panic in the front, and then in the back we have a more older fantasy series, so I'm combining the newer fantasy complete series and the older complete, or as complete as, um, I can get it <laughs> series all together on this shelf so this shelf is all finished i also added a cute little halloween decoration i got at the dollar store today earlier <laughs> so yeah that's one shelf down <laughs> and we just have to fix this one and then fill these ones okay ow fuck <sighs> I'm deciding that I'm going to put the ones that are technically complete, but I don't know if I'll continue collecting them and then a series that I'm in the series I'm probably going to get rid of. I'm going to put them like back there for now because I don't feel like dealing with selling and unhauling at the moment. <laughs> okay, now this is done. I started with the shoujo beat that are more fantasy series. Um, and then I just went along. So the ones back there are actually ones I'm considering unhauling or just like I'm not gonna finish collecting some of them. So I just kind of tossed them all back there. I don't know what to do with them yet, but I don't feel like selling or getting rid of them at the moment. So yeah, I kept this shelf pretty much the same. <laughs> and then I reorganized this a bit. Um, I do want to get like another to egg cartons eventually so that it isn't so much like that but for now it has to work now i'm gonna work on filling up this one <laughs> i ended up buying these bookends it was a pretty good price and it's like white so i felt like it went with my room decor aesthetic whatever <laughs> but um yeah they like i got them for like probably five dollars each set because i think it was all together like almost not quite 20 and then tax, so that wasn't bad and I'm hoping they look nice up on the shelves. <laughs>
had to put on top of a complete series. And it just didn't fit over there. <laughs> We're not gonna talk about it. And I still have one, the small bookshelf to put together. But right now I'm just putting continuing, like ongoing series. I think I'm gonna put like series that I'm still collecting but are finished on like one specific shelf. And I think I'm gonna move all like fantasy type series onto the shelf over there. <sighs> I don't know, I gotta figure out that situation. All right, I finished up this bookcase. I have pretty much done like ongoing until there and those are actually complete series but I'm still collecting them. <laughs> and then at the very bottom, I have some, I don't know if I wanna continue these series. And then decorations, I, I, I gotta put my merch somewhere. I gotta decide where to put my merch. I did this one. I'm staying out of the mirror. I look a mess. It is hot. But yeah, I got all my Dawn Man on the top and then a little on the shelf. And then I got my webtoons. I did all the webtoons except for like the action webtoons. Um, so I kept those in the other room, but like all the DL webtoons and then all the villainous ones. And then all my villainous and reincarnated and reset manga and bleeding into some fantasy shoujo. You know, not everything. It's just, it's the way my brain like decided it wanted things to work next. <laughs> it doesn't make sense probably to everybody, but it makes sense to me. And here we have the final little bookshelf with all these complete series on it. And then an incomplete complete series at the bottom and some Japanese volumes I just kind of stuck there. that was the room makeover <laughs> room uh update <laughs> and i hope you had fun i know it was a bit all over the place and i did try and show some books as i went it's just very hard to like set up the tripod and i'm like using my mom's old tripod that like would fit an old camera to then use my small tripod like attached to the tops it's very you know um what are they what do you call it uh i want to say cheap you know i, I could say cheap <laughs> um but i was thinking thrifty yeah that's what i was thinking thrifty it's <laughs> repurposing old things instead of buying new but uh yeah so sorry especially the second half i kind of just like was just showing you the aftermath of it and like how it ended up um and not so much the process it also was extremely hot like it got like 90s and humid and i was just like sweating like a pig and not really wanting to share how i was looking so it was just kind of like here you go here guys 
you look at the bookshelves so yeah so anyway that was the vid and uh <laughs> Subscribe if you want more fun content. <laughs> I promise next week there will be more detailed, more like uh, sit down talking about manga content again. It's just nice to break it up with something that I already was going to do. So why not film it and share the process with you? Either liked it or you didn't. So <laughs> until next time. Bye.